She's going to the sodding Brits. I am not entirely sure. I'm very, I, mm, mm, string a sentence together, Cassie, give it a second. There we go. It is Monday the 31st of January. And on Friday, I got an email from somebody at YouTube basically saying, hello, the YouTube is the Brits digital partner um, for this year. Would you like to come along? I am still sure that they've got this wrong. But I replied so quickly to confirm my spot that they now cannot take this away from me. I don't know how this has happened, but I am overwhelmed, grateful, extremely nervous and anxious about this whole thing. And I need to take you along the entire visual aesthetics process of this. By the way, if you're new here, my name's Cassie and I'm a self-diagnosed luxury addict. I've had videos on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays, so if you like luxury fashion, then you're gonna love it here. So head down there, subscribe, turn on the bell, become a member of our luxury addicted family. When are we going to rehab? Uh -huh. <gasps> Never. Guys, oh my gosh, this is starting happening. I don't know how this is going to go. Right, I haven't been given any more details, as in, I don't know if they're gonna sit me at the back near the toilets and, you know, I've got to have binoculars to see what's happening, okay? I am flustered. Now, I have been to, because look, not all these things are made the same. For example, I know it's not the same thing, but let me hear me out. For example, my mum won some random auction and got us tickets to prem the premiere of Rocket Man. You know, the film about Elton John. Excellent film, may I add. It was made out to seem like, oh my gosh, you're going to be on the red, same red carpet as the, as the stars, all this. You know, I was, I came correct dressed and all of that. And then when you go on the red carpet, there was literally like, they looked at your ticket and they were like, yeah, okay, so left... For, for those of us commoners or like, I don't know, competition winners and right for the celebrities. And our red carpet is about two metres long and the premiere was an in an entirely different cinema to the one that the celebrities are in, okay? This may be of that situation. So I don't know what to wear. However, I do know somebody that is also going and has gone to the Brits previously. I was like, look, is it a gown situation or are we a midi and a mini dress? And she was like, it's a midi mini dress situation. So I've started looking at options. Of course I have. Um, I also may or may not have already bought the bag that I'm going to wear with it. So let me show you. Dress number one is this. What would we even call it? It's not a yellow, it's like a gold Alexa uh, Alexandre Vauthier stunning midi dress, okay? I've not had a Vauthier before. I'm excited for this to be fit. You know I love a strong shoulder. She's strong shoulder. I think it cuts off nicely. I think it's interesting. I really like that. And if I was going to go with that one, I would style with... Keep that dress in your sod in mind, right? We do that. We do... Everybody knows yellow and purple. Purple is the complementary colour to yellow, all right? And then we do a tiny bag that I've already bought. I'll show you the tiny bag after the other dress options, okay? Dress option number sodding two, another Alexandra Vauthier, a little bit more of a party girl. She's more of a mini dress. She's very statementy, all of that, right? Like, this is like after party, you know? Um, so that's the vibe I'm getting for that. But if I was going to wear that, I would have done that. I would have done the valentinos let's just let's just bring bring it home and what bag would i have done with that i would have had to go with a pop-up color for a bag it probably would have been the bag that i've just bought once again and the final option i had Roberto cavalli she's got a turtleneck she's got a strong shoulder what's that so i did open back i never do open back okay so if i was doing this i would have done something like a black sandal. All of those dresses I would wear again. But I'm not gonna lie to you, the one that is the most like, that I just felt, I saw it and I was like, yes. It was the first one, the gold Vauthier. So I think it might have to be the gold sodding Vauthier. Now let me show you the sodding bag that I've already gone and bought because I saw it in Selfridges the other day and it was almost as though it was just like, I just need a good excuse and this turned out to be the right excuse. Um, it's tiny, of course it is. I know that some people think tiny bags are going out. I said it once, I'll say it again. TBE is not a trend, it's a lifestyle. Look at this absolutely tiny, it's right. So the brand is Lalingi, and shockingly, she fits cards, right? 
here's another there's another angle I love the little crystal handle all of that love 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 fantastic it is Tuesday I ordered that tiny bag yesterday oh god how am I gonna get this open and it's come today talk about speedy why is the adhesive so strong Hey, there we go We've cracked it. Da, 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 da. Ra, ba, ba, ba. La lingi. Heavy box. Okay, okay. Oh, right, yes. Well, hey, beautiful. We hope you love your new bag. La lingi team. Thank you. Certificate of authenticity. My God, it's that past the parcel. Oh, it's cute. It's kind of not the same colour that I thought it would be. It's kind of not as yellow, right? I mean, it's going to go with the shoes. It's going to go with the shoes, okay? But I love the colour anyway. It's like oil slicky and it has that like purpley green. But that is not a sunset. It's like, I, I just, I just love how ridiculous it is. Okay, little zip, zip opening. I'm not going to get much in this, am I? No, I'm not. It's for the vibes. It's for the vibes. Chain strap. I like the chain, actually. It's not a flimsy chain. Can you see? She's off. She's off to the Brits. Okay, update. I'm going to book a makeup person. I went... All I did was basically search the hashtag London makeup artist and go through the pages and see whose A work I liked and B then I messaged them to see if they're available. And I really like the girl that I've picked. I'll put her profile thing here. The crazy amazing thing that happened with the dress was that I basically was a bit cheeky and I reached out to Farfetch and I was like, is there anything you'd like to do around the dress and all of that for this event that I'm doing? And basically we're doing like a brand deal around it. They gave me credit for the dress and then I bought the dress and then we'll post um, Instagram and stories and whatever. So that's great how that's worked out. It is Thursday and I am sweaty because I've had to do a lot of outfit changes, but the dress has arrived. Uh -huh. Grazie. Thank you for shopping with us. 15% mm, discount in the uh, Di Vincenzo boutique. I shall accept. Okay. Right, they've given me its dress bag, fantastic, and the hanger. I'm not going to turn down a good hanger. Yes. Da -da -da -da. The colour is glorious. Oh my gosh, okay, I like the way it feels. I like the way it feels. <gasps> she's wrinkled, but we have time. God, she's very wrinkled. Dear me, she needs a bit of Botox and a steam. Let's try it on. Thoughts? Oh god, do you like it? Are you, uh, yes! Yes, of course I do. It looks so, so good. Also, because of the ruching, right? You don't need to keep going up and down. Because of the ruching, even after I eat and food baby, it's not going to be that noticeable. What's ruching? This gathering, gather, gather. <gasps> it's so me, isn't it? Imagine with heels. Yes? Do you love? I love it. I love. She's Irish dancing out of excitement. <laughs> Today is the day, okay? And I know what you're thinking. You should be more excited. And here's the thing. At, at the moment, it's too early and I'm stressed, <laughs> okay? I will be excited. Actually, do you want to know what? I'm not going to be excited until I'm physically at the O2 Arena, okay? Because up until then, I will be stressed, nervous, Think of everything that could possibly go wrong because that is my personality but the thing that's stressing me out on top of this is all the content that i need to do so i've got stories that i need to do for farfetch i've got the outfit picture that i need to take youtube shorts reels tiktoks i've got to make sure that all of those are different from each other so that I'm not just repurposing the same content. Basically I'm trying to milk this for whatever it's worth, okay? I've, I've not been to the sun in Brits before. Um, forgive me, but I'm stressed as well because Nee's not going to be here to help me take any of those Reels TikToks shorts because he's out from one o'clock. 
so I haven't even told you who I'm going I'm going with Parisa my my friend Parisa she's been on this channel a few times right these are the protocols okay I've got to present an NHS COVID pass and I think I've already downloaded this. Guests will be guided to level one or level four. I have my tickets here and I think I'm on level four. Cloakrooms, there are no cloakrooms. Do not bring any hall doors, backpacks, briefcase, overnight bags or similar. We would like to remind guests that there will be strobe, laser lighting and pyrotechnics. Hello, we'll be used throughout the show. Cassie, can you stop worrying? Can you stop worrying? I couldn't sleep last night because I was worried. Why do you worry? Because you end up wasting time i've wasted worrying there and what i mean by that is i've worried about something that's not even worth worrying about so i have wasted this stress get over it all right she's had a shower she's feeling better she's got her sodding energy back it might also be because i made myself a little coffee i'm excited i'm no longer stressed i'm excited i am a little bit stressed because I've still got things to do. Look, I've got my sodding checklist written out. What we've done now, well, what we're going to do now is... Have I told you about this? So I bought this Sally Hansen airbrush legs leg makeup. Had I seen this on TikTok a few times and it had rave reviews, yes. Now I've got this in the colour medium because I wanted something subtle, okay? Um, go back to what I believe is my natural skin tone because whatever I am now since COVID, I've never seen myself like this. Okay? Anyway, I've just done it on my arms and my chest just so it gives a little bit of something. Also, this is water resistant, so I think it only washes off with like soap and water and it doesn't transfer, thank God, because what I don't want is residue. Okay? So we're gonna do that on the legs. We're also got I've got my makeup. She's coming at four o'clock, so until then, what am I doing? I'm filming any more little social media bits that I need to do. Uh, I'm also gonna tape the titties. This is boob tape. This is also the first time I'm using this. The, the original breast tape. And what apparently you do is put it under the breast, hoist it up, stick it down. And it means that A, I don't have to find some sort of complex and ridiculous strapless looking bra, but also it doesn't have a, a little bit in the middle there because it is a plunge. But the titties are still gonna be where they should be and we're not gonna get any nipple action okay so that should do that what else have i told you these are the earrings i'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for those i think it's gonna look great with the dress we've got the purple aminas and we've got my little lalingi i don't know i just want to say it like that all right how are we doing i also need to edit this i need to edit this mm. to get it up in time that sounded like a fart it wasn't it was my phone and i'm gonna be overdressed but it's fine because you'd rather be overdressed than underdressed wouldn't you yes um, I also would like to take the opportunity, why well, have I decided to do this now? Don't ask me. Okay. Um, I would also like to take this opportunity to thank you all, seriously, because I've been invited to this with YouTube because they see potential in my channel or they like what, they, what I'm doing or whatever. And it is thanks to you guys clicking that big red subscribe button and cheering me on every step of the way. Tears shall not fall from my eyes today. I cannot, I cannot, I'm a very emotional person, Pisces. But really thank you. Thank you for being on this crazy journey with me. It is simply a pleasure to do what I do and to interact with you and um, to bring a bit of a smile and a giggle to your mon Monday, Wednesday, Fridays. That is, that's my job. Thank you for supporting me and Meaning that I get to go to crazy things. I'm off to the Southern Brits. I'm off to the Brit Awards. That's like our oh, Grammys. Hey, dear. Ah, the pressure's am stressed again. Am st Calm down, Cassie. So, this is what we're going to do. Shaky shake. You probably won't even see a difference. Onto the mitt. I have to buy this mitt for this purpose. Do we see a difference? Pretend as though you do. Next up. I'm going to steam, this isn't the steamer, that's my hair dryer, so let's play that back. It's yes, we're going to steam it. But Cassie, why do you have a random sock in your hand? Well, I saw a trick. What I've heard is, before we turn it on, is that you should put a sock on the end of it. Is this sock too small? No, because if any water comes out, it's going to catch it in the sock and it's not going to go on the thing. We have enough time to dry if it does go on it, but sodding precautions. We're off to the races. Are we good? I feel like sodding Charlie's Angel here. 
if Charlie's Angels specialised in laundry. The rest of it, I mean, because it's such a drapey dress, there's going to be the odd wrinkle, isn't there? Anyway, did want to show what perfume I'm wearing this evening. Bond number no. 9 New York Nights, one of my favourite perfumes of all time and I thought, do you want to know what? She wants to smell rich and interesting. I look like a Barbie. Do we see the full look? Well, titties are up. That boob tape, let me tell you, fascinating, okay? But it does a sudden good job. Go back. We're here and we are. This is Parisa. Parisa, say hello. Hello. Your makeup looks really good. Thank you. Honestly. Pat McGrath. Oh, Pat McGrath counter at Selfridges. Get it. Wait, we need to do your outfit. Run ahead. Hey, there we go. She's giving us Morticia Adams with a bit of flair. If you've enjoyed it, tell your friends. If you haven't, keep your mouth shut. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.